What do you do when you catch a 700 pound tuna? Well, just ask Jake Hiles. The Virginia Beach fisherman made history off the coast of the Oregon Inlet on Saturday, and he's sharing his remarkable story only with Philip Townsend. What a weekend for Captain Jake Hiles. It all started here at Rudy Inlet Saturday morning. By night, the fisherman and his buddy Jeff would be 80 miles southeast off the coast of North Carolina. In an area called the Tuna Hole. The plan was to catch big tuna. Setting this record was, was my goal for this winter. Now after wrestling several big fish that night, Jake was exhausted and he had nothing to show for it. So we tried to get a little sleep. I woke up to, to Jeff yelling that, that we had a fish on and I watched all the monofilament go off the rod. I watched all the Dacron go off the rod. This, this fish was literally going down to the bottom and I'm, I've got a mile of water under me and I've got a mile of line. But after an exhausting hour long fight, it was theirs. And when the sun came up, I went and took a look at it. And I, as soon as I went back and looked at it, I was like, man, that's gonna be the new state record. That's right, they were looking at a 708 pound bluefin tuna, the biggest tuna ever caught recreationally in Virginia. They couldn't sell it because it wasn't caught commercially, and a bluefin doesn't freeze well. So Jake posted an open invite to the docks at Rudy Inlet. There were probably three or 400 people there. Within one hour, that entire fish was completely gone. Everybody got to appreciate that, that, that fish, you know, so. A record-breaking weekend only made sweeter by something personal. The previous record holder, it was Jake's friend Chase Robinson a young fisherman who passed away in 2015. While records are meant to be broken, I always thought that if Chase would want one of his buddies to, to break his record. For 13 News Now, I'm Philip Townsend.